Hey folks, it's Mark with Saline Lunacy RV Edition. I'm here with Lolo, our 99 Rialta Classic, and I'm gonna to talk today a little bit about our what was probably our biggest DIY project, and that was stripping of all the exterior decals and then exterior paint. Uh, and if you stick around to the end, we'll show you how you could potentially save thousands on a job like this in working with your local body shop. As you'd expect, the graphics on this 20-year-old coach have seen their better days. It had to go. Also had some corrosion in a few spots where the coach fairing met the cab. Had to be taken care of as well. The plan from the beginning was to remove the decals from the cab and the rear and buff those sections and only repaint the aluminum side panels. Action. Hello's getting naked. <laughs> So we're removing all of the decals. You can see they're pretty crackled. For the front and rear of the vehicle, what worked best on all the stripes was a heat gun, plastic razor blades, and a lot of patience. You can see we managed to get all of those beautiful stickers off of the cab. And the cab looks pretty great, but we had some rust going on over here. So that has been osphoed and primed somewhat to take care of that rust and we'll be painting from here back and all of this metal has to be primed and repainted. It's pretty common on these suckers that the paint comes off and so we're going to make her pretty, pretty, pretty. We tried a variety of different techniques on the side panels, but at the end of the day, the rubber eraser wheels from 3M, slow speed with moderate pressure, worked the best. There was no process that we tested, though, that we were successful in not removing the paint. So if you're going to remove the decals on these panels, you're going to have to repaint. We found this dude walking down the street and drug him over here to help us mask off the van. Yeah. Needed a job. We didn't tell him we weren't paying him. What are you doing? I'm sanding. It's so much fun. It's fun because it's going to be awesome. When you're Other than that, no, it's not fun at all. What are you doing? Not sanding. Jeff was just saying he really wanted to be interviewed. <laughs> How did you end up here, Jeff? What's up? How'd you get conned into this? I, I kind of did. Because I put on Facebook I need some help with my job. And I was like, why does Mark want to help me out? And I, I got to thinking after I said, yeah, man, show up. I was like, oh, he really needs my help. He really needs, <laughs> he really needs an RV done. I was like, all right, I got you, bro. Very nice of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it was nice of him, too. Well, it was nice to catch up. No, you don't want to do that. I mean, if you don't have it here, I'll just take it home. It's mostly a straight line. What is that? It's a tack cloth. It's a sticky cheesecloth that you just wipe down before you do your uh, final spraying and it gets all the fine dust uh, off, of, you some fine off dust. of the surface. Yeah. It's almost time to paint. So what are you doing, thinning it? I have to mix it up first and then oh. I have to thin it out. Now this is going to be a task. You have to scuff sand all of the primer with 320 before final paint, 
that makes the primer stage a little more forgiving, so we sprayed both sides out in the open on this day. Brought to you by Modelo. Primer's done, and now we have to remove all of the... Masking! <laughs> nice! <laughs> Skyhook! Woo! We are weather dependent on painting, so hopefully this weekend we'll get to uh, have a good weather break and we will remask tape off all over again and get it painted. Paint day. Today we will be painting the driver's side. Welcome to Adult Fort Building 101. We box this in so we can uh, spray cleanly today. Fingers crossed the wind didn't pick up. There's a bit of a tent set up and now it's time to tape. Okay, she is masked for the first side. Now we just have to sand, wipe, and paint. That's all. I kind of like this. It's like, you know, the graphic tape is here, but it's like... I'm You're excited to get, it, to get it done, but not necessarily excited to do it. <laughs> First side is painted, and as long as the weather holds tomorrow, we'll get the second side painted, and she'll be done on the outside. All right, it's our final masking day. Today we'll be spraying the last side of Lolo. Mark's doing some sanding prep. Super excited that this is the last day. Glad it's not windy. <laughs> Action Jackson. Time to see what's underneath. So shiny. If you enjoyed this video or think it was helpful, please like and subscribe. If you're interested in the cost breakdown, visit us at www.salinglunacy.com for the details.